Welcome back to Roscoe. A charming little fairy tale castle exists in the Catskills that not many people know about. And the reason for that, I suspect, is because it is on private land with surveillance cameras and no convenient parking nearby. So many don't bother, including yours truly, until now. V and I meant to hike to Russell Brook Falls in Roscoe one weekend morning, but because of icy packed snow, we turned back and decided to visit nearby Dundas Castle instead. Up there is Dundas Castle in Roscoe, New York. It's right beside the road, as you can see, but there's no parking, so I parked on the shoulder of the road. It's private property and there's uh, surveillance cameras all around, so if you do come here, be very, very respectful of the place. Dundas Castle was meant to be a vacation lodge, but construction stopped when the owner died in 1924. A replica castle in the Gothic and Elizabethan revival styles, the medieval Scottish-inspired castle looked out of place in this backcountry woodland in the Catskills, known more for tannery, logging, and rustic barns then say horse-mounted knights charging to breach its castle walls. It is called Dundas because the owner's name was Wirtz Dundas, a descendant of the wealthy Wirtz family that built the Delaware and Hudson Canal back in the 1800s. Dundas Castle can become a major attraction in my opinion, especially with other Catskill attractions nearby. No need to cross the pond, mount a horse, or suit up in armor. Great images can be taken from outside Dundas Castle without ever having to breach its castle walls. So that's it from Roscoe, New York. Bye!